how do value and growth stocks typically respond to economic downturns and how can I ensure my portfolio portfolio, excuse me, is balanced to handle potential future recessions? That's another great question. And I'll, I'll refer to the slide where I showed you where value was down four and a half and growth was down 35%. In volatile times, people will flee growth stocks and go into treasury bonds and value-oriented investments. It's simply, I, I can't say it enough, working with retirees for the past 30 years, I personally like to sleep at night as well as I want my clients to be able to sleep at night. And value-oriented investments are just less volatile. Businesses are more stable. A lot of these stocks pay dividends, so you get paid while you're waiting, whereas growth stocks don't, all right? Growth stocks are typically, like I said, newer economy, leading edge technologies, these sorts of things. Yeah, everybody wants them in the beginning. But I'll tell you what, in tough times, recessionary times, high interest rate times, Lord only knows what the next geopolitical risk is out there. I mean, heck, there's a war that was started 18 months ago in Eastern Europe. You just never know. People will want to run away from growth stocks and they will go to value just because of the stability. So uh, I hope that helped. Mm -hmm.